So this week at Yanomize, what do we have? Obviously, we always start at the front. Burt's car's there. It's an M50D. Yes, I know on the last one I said I, but it is an M50D. My SVR Urban Range Rover is still here, sat in black. I haven't sold it yet since last week. Who knows what's going to happen next week? Lamborghini Urus with the full Nero body kit and 24 inch wheels. This car has carbon everywhere. If you want a body kit for a Lamborghini Aventador S, Urus or Huracan, you need to check out Nero guys. Yes, I am a part owner. I own it with Simon from Urban. Uh, but there it is in all her glory. That's also got matte PPF. This customer's already had off us um, Range Rover, Bentley wrap, uh, Porsche Panamera with Nero wheels. Um, he's had loads and loads of cars, but I think this is his latest. Oh no, Bentley GT, we just wrapped recently, but this is his latest toy. And as I said, he's on his way now to pick it up. He's gonna love this. And the sun's shining. Uh, where should we go, where should we go? You know, let's go in this one first. So in here, we've got an orange Evogue. Now, this is probably gonna split opinions. The car, we wrapped it in orange. The car's gray originally. The customer wanted to keep all the gray and the silver factory. He wanted to keep the gray roof, but he wanted to go gloss black mirrors with gloss black wheels. I'm not sure, what, what do you think? So orange car with all the gray and silver bits kept as factory, but with gloss black wheels and gloss black mirrors, but the gray roof. I don't know. If the customer likes it, I'm happy. Personally, I tried to push him to go for a gloss black roof. He wasn't having it, so it's up to him. Behind me, another Lamborghini Urus, but this one's going like a cream peachy color. I think I mentioned it in the last week's video. However, all the comments are gonna be like, looks like Kanye West, looks like Kanye West, this car. Maybe it does. This car was yellow, it looks amazing in yellow. This car belongs to a young lady called Daisy. And obviously Nico, nope. Mark and Eamon are on the shuts. Nico must be here somewhere. He's not too, he's never usually far away from Mark. Uh, but anyway, so they're wrapping the shuts. As you can see, it's in one piece. And cream, looks different. Want it done? Oops, don't do that. Sorry, Mark. <laughs> don't mess with Mark, yeah? So Nico's not in here, Nico must be next door. Range Rover Vogue in for Ghost. We fit Ghost daily. What is a Ghost? It's a Ghost Immobilizer. So people are stealing cars, these are the easiest car to steal. Ghost Immobilizer stops them from stealing the car. How? It's a cutoff switch, so that means then when they try to start the car, they clone your key, they can't do it. It needs a sequence to start the car. Pav is usually the guy that fits these. I don't know where he is. I'm here. Oh, well, there you go, there's Pav. So he's doing this, and also we're fitting a Ghost on, actually onto the Orange Evogue as well. Certain cars have certain sequences. So like on a Range Rover, you can use like the paddle shift, or you can use the buttons. On an Audi, it might be the window switches. You can have a sequence from two up to 10. Um, I don't think you want a 10 sequence. Imagine sitting there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You'll be there forever starting the car, but it is really, really cool and does stop people from stealing the car. The only way really you can steal something like that is if you lift it. And by the time they lift it, you would hear it at your house. They steal these, they put like the, um, you know like the scanner to scan the keys. They do that at the front of your door. And once they get that, they start the car, five, 10 seconds, car's gone. Get a ghost, get a ghost, get a ghost. Come to us, come to us, or a tracker. And a tracker, tracker and a ghost. Right, as we walk around, there's the yellow doors for the Urus. It's like an assault course, we're moving in and out. In the back, the PPF bay, we've got a brand new Ferrari Portofino. So you saw this last week, it's actually now been PPF'd. The next car I think arrives on Friday, so next week's video, you'll see a different car in here. Um, so this is paint protection, the whole car is being covered, so the customer loves the red, just wants it protected uh, from stone chips or like wear and tear out and about on the roads. Sal is normally in here, I usually finish the videos in here. Sal's normally in here, he's not here today, it's his birthday. Happy birthday, Sal. Everyone wish Sal a happy birthday. Let me ask you a question. I don't take a day off when it's my birthday. Do you? Comment down below, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. What are you gonna do, it's a day off, everyone's at work. I don't know. So over here, we have Lamborghini Aventador SV, one of 600. Um, it's like a, it's a different color, like a bluey gray color, you wanna call it. It's got massive spec, it's got a full carbon roof, which is very rare on these cars. Um, this is actually going to go in Nosatec purple. It's going to look amazing. And he's trying to decide what to do with the SV badge down the side. If he's going to um, put a full orange SV down the side, or if he's going to just do an outline of the SV in the purple, make it, we'll fill it up. Uh, but that's real cool. Next to this, we'll call it wallpaper. Um, Porsche Macan, 
people are gonna be like, ah, oh, that's not really camo. I don't think it's supposed to be camo. It's supposed to be a single print all around the car. So obviously when you lay it, you lay it down as one piece um, to make sure it matches all the way down the car. And then obviously the bumpers are slightly different. It's gonna split opinions. Gloss black wheels as well, tinted windows. People are gonna love it, people are gonna hate it. I'm sure the customer will love it when he collects it. Another Ferrari Portofino here. This belongs, actually I can't reveal who it belongs to right now. However, there will be a video on this car. It's going a crazy color. And the person that owns this has got about 5 million Instagram followers. So he or she is big. Right, let's go into the other unit. This is like the wash bay. This is like the Michelin man wash bay, um, as you can see. So there's the man right there. Yeah, and my stickers, wash bay. No cars in here today. I don't know why. My car needs to come in for a wash, actually. So in here, in like the new unit, um, Rolls-Royce Wraith. Uh, it's having a chrome delete. It's already got the wheels, but he does want 24 inch wheels. I'm gonna do satin black over the top. So front to back, we'll have satin black. I've got a Porsche car in here in satin black. Um, this belongs to Barney, friend and customer. So it's having full satin black wrap. And then as we move across, uh, D-Block Europe, LB. That is his Range Rover. So that is also satin black. It's having yellow calipers, I want to say. Could be red. Yellow or red? Job sheet, anyone? One second. They're going red? We have our little job sheet that tells me. Yep, Terry was right. Terry, the manager from the Animize, was right for once. Um, only Jay can tell, love you. Uh, satin black, shots and returns. Uh, wing mirrors are staying, gloss black, top half, so lower half, sorry, top half is staying gloss black and red calipers. Yes, yeah, so that's LB's car from D-Block Europe. And I think that finishes the video. I might finish it with Tev. I've got Tev here, man like Tev. Um, everyone was like, he's got like a Jamaican accent and he's got this and he's got that. Tev, are you Jamaican? I'm from Jamaica, yes. Moved here in 2008, so I've been in the country about 11 years, 12 years now. So everyone that said that he's Jamaican, they are correct. You've got Daniel behind, that's Daniel. Daniel's from South Africa. No, he's not, he's not, he's not. Where are you from, Daniel? Uh, New Zealand. New Zealand, so Jamaica, New Zealand, Cyprus, and you've got Terry from England. He's over there. Anyway, I'm concluding this video right now. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you like this content where I show you a walk around every week. Let me know. I'll see you soon, take care. So we just filmed the video, however, Michelle, the owner of the Urus, has just turned up in the Panamera that I spoke to you about. So this is here for full PPF, but it does have the Nero wheels. Um, it is crayon, so obviously it's keeping the original colour. Usually it wraps everything. But yeah, so I've just added this into the video now. So you'll probably see this next week in the PPF Bay. Elliot will show you around. Baby, I'm a bike, but one bike is dead. So if you're gonna fight me for my heart, I